So strange an accident has happened to us that I cannot forbear writing it. When my guest was a little recovered, I had great trouble to keep off the men who wished to ask him a thousand questions. Once, however, the lieutenant asked why he had come so far upon the ice in so strange a vehicle. His countenance instantly assumed an aspect of the deepest gloom, and he replied, To seek the one who fled me. One of the phenomena which had particularly attracted my attention was the structure of the human frame, and, indeed, any animal endued with life. Whence, I often asked myself, did the principle of life proceed? Well, my father's name is Alphonse Frankenstein. Frankenstein? You must create a female for me with whom I can live in the interchange of those symphonies necessary for my being. I shall be with you on your wedding night! What is it that agitates you, my dear Victor? What is it that you fear? Oh, peace, peace, my love. This night and all will be safe, but this night is dreadful, very dreadful. Many times I considered Satan as the fitter emblem of my condition. For often, like him, when I reviewed the bliss of my protectors, the bitter gall of envy rose within me. Oh,